Several Quincy families lost everything after their house went up in flames. Coming just before Christmas, the fire is tough on those families directly affected. But the community is turning out in a big way. Deshani Whitlow reports on the effort by neighbors to help these families in their time of need. Life's delicate. I'm just thankful that nobody was hurt. Daylight reveals the extent of damage to this Winthrop Street home in Quincy after a fire destroyed the property days before Thanksgiving. By the time firefighters arrived, the second and third floor was already engulfed in flames. One neighbor taking the family out of the cold and into his home. Kid that burnt his finger shots in a t-shirt. So he says, uh, find some stuff here. Go upstairs, find some stuff, shoe, whatever you need. And then he went to the hospital to get the burns looked at. Investigators are looking into whether some type of battery is to blame for the fire. I'm just thankful that, you know, it was contained, didn't, uh, the firefighters did an excellent job, didn't spread to any of the surrounding property. Firefighters battled the flames and wicked winds Friday. Now, this community is coming together to help those in need. They're really tightening it down here. Quincy firefighter Lieutenant Robert Laracy says donations have been pouring into the Howes Neck fire station since Friday. People have been coming in, they've been bringing blankets, uh, jackets, new clothing, um, anything to help out for the community. With a long road ahead of them, every little bit helps. Several GoFundMe accounts have been established to help the families. The structure is in rough shape, but that could be replaced. Lives, not so much. In Quincy, Tashani Whitlow, CBS in Boston.